that was shocking, that. I expected a big explosion there. They must be left off from bonfire night then. <laughs> I used to love bonfire night. Me and our Julie, my mum, used to stand it back kitchen when they were the ghouls on. <laughs> mum would turn the light off so we could get the full effect. <laughs> and um, we used to have sparklers, we used to light them at gas fire, stick them in between bars, and then when they light, ooh, run outside quick, so you can write your name, Peter, Peter, uh, Julie. <laughs> and my dad would be outside with a tin, giving it. But readers. <laughs> this one's called the tornado. <laughs> this one's called the volcano. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> This one's called the Whistling Gypsy. <laughs> right, <laughs> names they had. Traffic lights, you just go get red and green and then just fall over. What traffic lights did that? <laughs> Putting rockets in sterilised milk bottles. <laughs> used to that. They still do sterilised milk. <laughs> do they? No, I don't think they do, do they? What, at back, at, at back shop? <laughs> at Offy? They do sterilised milk at Offy? I don't, I mean, we used to send me for sterilised milk. We used to have to go and get that. And a uh, fries five centre, that was my mum's treat. Get me a fries five centre. <laughs> Quarter of midget gems for my dad. <laughs> the walnut whip. And our off licence sold everything. And I mean everything. You could go in at quarter to two in the morning and get a canoe. <laughs> I'm going in once, going, everything's Tony. Well, not so bad, you know, I'm still pissing blood. Diabetes, you know. No, fair enough. Well, a bottle of sterilised milk, please. <laughs> <laughs> you know, last day of school, last day of term. I just love last day of term. You know, you could, you could either bring a game in. You could run close for 10p and bring a game in, like a plunk. <laughs> or a tank commander, or a crossfire. Or, or a ma mastermind with that Vietnamese lady on box. Remember that? <laughs> Who was she? <laughs> Who was she? <laughs> oh, you can wear your own clothes for 10p. You've got to wear your own clothes for 10p. I might like, ask me uniform, it's not hired. This is my own uniform. I'm a mufti. The teachers, oh, you went on a school trip, you see, you go on a trip. I mean, like an LSD thing. I mean, you go on coaches or something somewhere. And you go off somewhere on a trip. And then, um, you know, teachers, teachers used to turn up in their play clothes. They have like cagoules on. You know, you laughing up there. Cagoule or blue jeans. Are you a teacher? Really, really, really blue jeans. Really bright blue with massive turnips. <laughs> Huge turnips, bright white trainers. Really shit trainers off market, like Gola, high tech trainers. <laughs> with flashing red lights on, bouncing down the road. Come on! You're on Coach A, you're on Coach B. So you've not paid 10p. Ah, come on, let's go. <laughs> Dinner ladies getting on, bit of cash in hand. Well, I'll do that. Escort for the day, got 30 quid, that'll do me. Come on, get on. Janice, Barbara, we're on. Auntie Sandra, not my real auntie though. Friend of family. Your pal on coach, you know, I'll get on and there'll be some, but them girls would always pretend they were drunk because they'd had a cider lolly. <laughs> or a sandy. Have a shandy lolly or a cider lolly, they pretend they were drunk. I'm drunk, come out of my head. <laughs> I'm drunk, if it's a back seat, where am I? <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> if you didn't go abroad for your holiday, then you had your, in your holiday in England. Glorious big six week holidays at home, playing out till 11 o'clock at night, flight nights, have a water fight, get an empty bottle of fur liquid, wear it front street, I'm having a water fight. I'm gonna want a mum, wash some pots. Wash some pots, I'm gonna have a water fight. Hurry up, wash some plates. I'm gonna have a water fight. Give me the It's full of suds, that. Why are you sitting there, mum? Squitting suds at other kids. <laughs> playing out in your slippers. How fast could you run in your slippers when you were a kid? <laughs> How fast would you run in your slip? Slippers are fast slippers. They're not three quid slippers off market. They're fast. Oh, yeah. When I used to, they should get slippers out to athletes. I do. I think that. 
Night slippers. They should give them out to us. We piss it at Olympics with night slippers. Because the fast one, I used to run chippy on a Friday night in my slippers. Fast. <laughs> Steve Austin, Ooh, slippers. <laughs> Playing out, go outside. Come in, never come in, really thirsty. Oh, I'm thirsty. Oh, I'm thirsty, I'm thirsty, I want to drink. Oh, I'm all thirsty, I want to drink, I want to drink. Give me a drink. Have a cup of tea. What? <laughs> Have a cup of tea. What do I want a cup of tea for? That's the best thing you can have if you're thirsty. You're not even Irish, mum. What's my name? <laughs> have a good cup of tea. That's the best thing you can have if you're thirsty. A good cup of tea that cools you down. <laughs> Bollocks. <laughs> you can you just see him at Wimbledon? Eh? Game set and match. Can you get the kettle on for these lads here? They're gasping. <laughs> then you go back to school in September and you can't write. I can't write. What's the matter with me? Can't write. Can't write. Six weeks or why don't you and your arms freak? I can't write. <laughs> Cannot write. What's the matter with me? Teachers, come on now. In assembly. Come on now. Quiet everybody, come on. Fingers on lips. <laughs> you ever do that school? Still talk. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Fingers on lips, come on. You're not on your holidays anymore. There's like one lad with a lilo and trunks and a snorkel. <laughs> 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 Look at all my gear out here. Rub that cream in, will you? Bullseye, Sunday afternoons. I used to love bullseye, I mean. It was weird bullseye, because it was shit and it was good. <laughs> Honest to God, you knew where you stood with bullseye. And every week, my sister used to say, out of this blitter car, between them. <laughs> out of, when, you know what, end up program, out of this blitter fitted kitchen with a chainsaw. Because <laughs> usually on bullseye, they were just Two people, they weren't related, they were usually from a pub. A clever one and a darts player. There were two blokes, or two women, usually couldn't tell whether women were blokes on Bullseye. <laughs> Leanne, she bit dart player, it's stonewashed denim. <laughs> Love and hat, tattooed on her knuckles, because she'd lost her finger. <laughs> Valerie, a friend, she'd be answering questions, she were, cle she were clever one, in maroon shell suit. Five o'clock shadow. <laughs> showbiz, Jim, showbiz. <laughs> showbiz I'd like, please, showbiz. <laughs> showbiz you'd like, showbiz you'd like. Okay, showbiz you'd like. <laughs> showbiz, Leanne. Woo! Spelling you've got, never mind. <laughs> Spelling you've got for four pounds. For four pounds, Valerie, could you spell hermaphrodite? <laughs> e R M A U T Ermarter Ermafra. I'll have to rush you, Valerie. I'll have to rush you, son. <laughs> when they run out of time on spelling, do you remember Bully used to walk across bottom at telly with a big dictionary? <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> Jim smacked off his tits. Don't know what day it is. <laughs> if you're going to go to Alton Towns, go with a dinner lady. Oh, not, not now, but you can if you want, don't mind. They'll light your candle. If you go, or go with a pensioner. Go with a pensioner. Because they, they, they won't want to go on anything. And they always walk, I guarantee you, they just walk around going, Oh, you won't get me on that thing. Go, right, hold me back. I'll be back in a week. <laughs> get on this one, get on this one here, get on this one. There's no queue. There's no queue. There's no queue, get on this one. No, there's no queue. You don't see 3,000 people on the side of Hill like, queuing for about a week. Like, snaked queues. One week from this point. <laughs> you go to Alton Towers now, though, and there's like rides like uh, the Oblivion. That, that's not a ride, that, no, it's not nice. That, you know, you queue for about a week and you have all that. Do you ride the oblivion and live? You can't go back. All these special effects and strobe lights and things. And you get to the front and you think, I'm just going to be good this. We're queuing for a week. And get there 
It's like T minus five minutes to embarkation. You think, oh, it's going to be good. And just for tear that Hollywood shine off it, some lad from Midlands going, do you mind taking your brace out, love? <laughs> what? You take your brace out. Why? Well, that's your. Now you'll just ruin the photograph for everybody else, you ugly bitch. Just take it out. <laughs> Bum 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 bum. Okay, you threw to Bully's prize board. Valerie, Liam, come this way. Come this way, boys. <laughs> okay. Now you're forty pounds. That's safe. That's going nowhere. Back pocket at Farrah. <laughs> now you've got the time it takes the board to revolve. What do you want to do? You can ask the audience. Come on, ask the audience. <laughs> what do you reckon? Well, we've had a right good day, dear. We've had a right good day, you know. <laughs> really enjoyed ourselves. Just being away from centre for a few hours is a blessing, you know. Because <laughs> Leanne's electronically tagged. <laughs> no, 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 no. What? Well, what? Well, we're going to gamble, Jim. We're going to go for it. We're going to gamble. <laughs> Let's have a look at the prizes, shall we? In one! <laughs> In one, kids won't have to suffer mum's roller cola anymore. <laughs> With this fantastic soda stream. <laughs> and bully special prize! A speedball, always a speedball. Where do they live? Tamworth. <laughs> 200 miles at sea. When they used to lose on Bullseye, what did Jim Bowen used to say? Let's have a look at what you could have won, yes, my friend. Let's have a look at what you could have won. Kick and win the down, Jim. <laughs> eh? Rub a bit of salt in wound, my friend. Let's have a look. He's bring speedboat on and show it him. Bring it on, boys. Boom, 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 boom. Take it back now, take it back. <laughs> They'll not see that again, you've shit out. Take it back. <laughs> Let's have a look at what you could have won. I always think you make a really bad priest a wedding, Jim Bowen. I know you pronounce your man and wife, the power invested in me. <laughs> Gary, Julie. Okay, Gary, before you whisk Julie, off to Tenerife. It's over there. OK. <laughs> Let's have a look at what you could have married. <laughs> oh, you slipped up there. She's 16, she's Filipino. Take a bite, boys. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Don't worry, you've still got your bendy bullies. <laughs> and your 40 pounds, it'll take me the commercial break to count it out. <laughs> 40 quid, Jim. <laughs> what is it in? Two peas? <laughs> Sunday afternoons, then I'd get ready for school on Monday morning, have a bath, get my hair dried, watching Art to Art and Magnum. <laughs> my sister would be upstairs in the back bedroom taping Top 40 off radio. <laughs> do you ever do that on Sundays, tape charts? And try and stop it before he speaks. <laughs> That's a skill, that. That's a skill. <laughs> Ultravox began as a non mover. Oh, shit. <laughs> Five star rain and shine. He's done two places. Oh, shit. shit. Come on. Do her own dance routines in the bedroom. <laughs> From Tamura. Tay, 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 Dancing, I'll come up there and give you something dance about. <laughs> Lady Jane, I'm trying to watch Highway down here. <laughs> Got school disco on a Thursday night. Have a bottle of 2020 behind a skip. <laughs> White lightning. <laughs> I'm pissed and I don't give a shit. Come on. <laughs> Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna run around, desert you. Too many broken hearts in the world, too many dreams can... 
You doing it wrong, watch me. <laughs> well, take the calipers off. What's the matter with your joy cell? <laughs> I won't give a fuck to you. <laughs> so you go on holiday and you arrive. First thing you should do is uh, open your case and get out some, get out a tin of beans, right? <laughs> beans and sausage, you've got the money, right? <laughs> open them up and throw them all over your wall. All over your wall in your apartment, all the way down, right? And then go around your apartment and take the time out to find a cockroach or an insect, something like that. Find it, pull all your bedding back, put it in your bed, right? And then go around and take photographs of each other, like this. <laughs> When we arrive, <laughs> send it to Tom Robinson on Watchdog and you get your money back for your holiday. <laughs> or go and take a camp card and get an holiday from hell. <laughs> Film it all, then people are like, oh, oh, them people. When I arrived on the Monday night, my children were very tired. I took them into the bathroom and I decided to bath them. I turned on the tap and what can only be described as shit came out <laughs> of the tap. I went to tell the manager and he assured me that it was perfectly natural for this time he had me rep. Didn't want to know. By the third day, my children were starting to smell of shit. <laughs> I was bathing my old children in shit. <laughs> Go! <Goal! laughs> Next week, family cruise, fire, chaos. I had to jump from the top deck of the ship with both my legs on fire. <laughs> that is not a holiday. He's watched television in class and he's wheeling this massive television on legs. It were up there. Two prefects who's wheeling it in like prize in a game show. <laughs> it were massive, you're like meerkats watching it like. <laughs> Put a video in lockbox, that'd have been nicked. Remote control and a wire. <laughs> Systematic stood on chair with Ariel trying to get a picture. Can you see? Can you fucking see now? Can you fucking see? I was never a fan of PE at school, me. I could see astonishment in your eyes, but I was never a fan. I don't... We can get up here. I was never a fan. I don't believe you can be physically educated. They used to make us walk on an upside-down gym bench. Did you ever do that? You used to balance walk along. Your weight's dropping off me now, sister. I used to pretend I forgot my kit. I forgot my PE kit. Get something out of that bin in the corner. Fencing mask and a netball skirt. Well. <laughs> Forward roll. <laughs> All changed. The ropes. Get on the ropes. Get on the ropes. Oh, they've been on the ropes twice now, sister. Sit on this pissing bench. <laughs> Something more for a big shot today. <laughs> we always got Asda. Because we can park in that parent and child bit that fronts at shop. <laughs> and with my mum, they don't put an age range on it, you might as well. You're right at fronts at shop, it's belting. <laughs> at least you know where you park when you come out, you're not like them dads that can't remember. I love seeing dads when they come out, they've no short term memory. When cars park there and they come out. <laughs> cars gone, bloody cars gone. Gee. Gee, car's gone. Do they do that dad run that dads do? I love that, where they don't actually move any quicker. They just... Have you seen that? Gee! <laughs> Bloody car's gone. Sierra, Sierra's gone. You might as well walk. What's that? Gee, but he can't. It's gone. We've had it. I love seeing people meet running for buzzes and then they miss them and then pretend they didn't want them. <laughs> What's all that about? <laughs> people are... Oh, people were weather. Oh, oh, it's too warm for me. Oh, oh, it's warm. I, I like it warm, but I don't like it this warm. <laughs> it's too warm, you know. There's warm and there's warm. <laughs> oh, I'm sweating cobs. What? Cob and cobs? I'm ringing, I'm wet through, look at me. Oh, it's sticky weather. It's sticky. <laughs> Clammy. I can't get me breath. Go! <laughs> it's called summer. Have a cellar and shut the cup, Bill, yeah? <laughs>
Beyonce Sandra is a, is a, a dinner lady. One of them pink women, one of them pink ladies you used to get at school, dinner lady. You know the one on the dinner break? Pink women, pink over, pink tabards, I love that word. Tabards and pink, pink legs, pink heads, pink hair. <laughs> Proper pink, you used to go around playground and stop me having any fun. Walk around. <laughs> Stop that, cut it out, you quit that. Don't do that, put that down. Three of them there were, they were, my auntie Sandra, but not my proper auntie. <laughs> and there were Janice and Barbara. And they'd go round, Stop that, stop, you're playing army. <laughs> army. Stop that, you're like somebody. I've got a stick for a gun. Who am I using with a stick? Dra. Oh, they're all in pain now, aren't they, love that? Dra. Dra. Lads, lads have three noises for guns. Dra. <laughs> and there was the shittest one, which were mine. Ha 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 a bit rained as well. If you were playing out and they'd go mad, they'd have these, they'd have fits, they couldn't believe it. They'd be like, they get all hysterical. They'd see them, they'd be stood about 100 yards apart and they could feel it coming, rain. They could feel it coming, they'd be like eyeing each other up and down. They were looking like that and they could sense it like that. Smell it, they could smell the rain. <laughs> One big splodge. Like it's spitting! It's spitting, it's spitting, everybody in, everybody inside, it's spitting. Janice Barra, get the kids, get inside, it's spitting. Get inside, on the playground, children, get inside, save yourselves. It's spitting. Can't begin to save in private, Ryan. Get inside. Ha, 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 ha. Not funny, I'm not laughing, I'm shooting people. I run pat lunches, me. Pat lunches were two spam sandwiches and a munch bunch yoghurt. <laughs> And a Robin of Sherwood lunchbox, a packet of salt and shake, island toffee, and a, a beaker. Mum used to give me a beaker with orange cordial with some cling film over the lids, it won't spill in my bag. <laughs> you don't want that all over your books. Give it back your books. What are that about? Backing books. Come, get me that wood chip wallpaper inside a wardrobe. <laughs> well, back my books here. Annie Glitter, razzle. Back my books here. <laughs> Keep me safe. Get alive. I used to love it when I went dining hall at school and someone would fall with a dinner. He just gets walking back to the seat, you'd get some girl walking. Back. <laughs> Everyone would go, way! When they were sick, they used to put sawdust down. What about about sawdust? <laughs> There's nothing to see. On your way. Of course there's something to see. She's throwing up sawdust here. She's throwing up sawdust. <laughs> some carpenter's daughter. Look at that, shavings. Blah, shavings. Should be embarrassing, buddy. She's a freak. <laughs> they were doing that at school reunion about half past ten. Everyone were drunk. Sister had doing it. We're going around with a bucket of sawdust, throwing it down. <laughs> you ever dip your biscuit in your tea and it breaks? Do you ever do that? Do you ever, I swear to God, now you never get used to that. As you get older and you dip your biscuit in it, because you don't know when it's going to fall, <laughs> and you panic when it falls. It's, it's like outer body. It's like slow motion. Like, Mom! Get a spoon! <laughs> me biscuits falling in me broom! <laughs> a real big sinking! <laughs> ah! Bastard! <laughs> Burn in the fingers! A real! You Rich tea are bad for that. Rich tea are the worst ones. They should be called one dips, Rich tea. That's all you get, one dip. You feel like lightning. They're the worst ones, Rich tea. You have to get four together to get a good chance of getting a dip in. They've no backbone. I'm willing them to have a bit of backbone. Like, come on, oh, car, it's too hot, it's too hot. Ooh. Biscuit, it's your job. 
Put on my arses, Rich T. They don't, they, and they're cocky. They're cocky. They don't even fit into your cup. You've got to bite a bit off or get them in your brew. <laughs> they're not like obnobs. You see, that's a different class of biscuit and obnob. Obnobs are like Marines, obnobs. They're like SAS, they're like Steven Seagal at Biscuit World, an obnob. You dip an obnob, it's like, again! Again, dip me, again! Dip me, again, I'm going nowhere, me son, dip me! Dip me! Dip me! They drink half your brew, they drink what? Where's my brew gone? Where's my brew? You don't dip me, I'll drink the bastard again! Again! You always leave loads of shit at the bottom of your cup, but ah, oh, yes, about. <laughs> you love the sun, me dad, which always made me wonder why we always went butlins for two weeks every year, and it always rained. Only time we ever saw me dad cry were at butlins finally, and when he trapped his balls in a sun lounger. <laughs> oh, oh yes, we went Lorette de Mar, it's over there, Lorette de Mar, and he uh, he got one of them, there were one of them white plastic sun loungers that sat at pool, but it had a crack right up middle of it. Right, but you, oh yeah, yeah. Gets out at pool, sits on it, but he puts his weight to the back of the lounger, thus opening the crack. Well, like a man trap. Opening, didn't see a thing, everything fell through, just fell through. Plop, that were it. Got the family jewels swinging in the wind, no? You know, you've been in water in the Anglota as well, but that far from concrete now, swinging down there. I went past on my Lilo, pissed me sides, didn't say a thing. <laughs> this is the life. In the San Miguel. Deirdre, where's my son at? That son's rough. Where's my son at? Pass me out there, will you, Pass me out there. Can't reach, just pass me. Ha! <laughs> Suffering Jesus. <laughs> Took five of us getting it back at ambulance. <laughs> Tell rat round him, still sat on sun lounger. Deirdre, 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 go and pick my dick up. Get me dick, love. Pick it, get it quick for it rolls it pool. They can sew it back on, put it in ice. Spent next two weeks kicking his balls down the beach. Yeah. Shops are bad when you go in shops. I don't like it when they start... You know when they think you've got forged money? And they make you feel... And there's a cue behind you. They start looking at you like, you know, you, they start holding up to the light, see if Queen's got a tash. Put it on that ultraviolet machine, you know. They make you feel... I went into one shop, I gave her a £20 note. She looked at me like I'd come into her house on Christmas Day and pissed on her kids. I said, hey! It's a £20 note, love. I'm not from Mars, so. When she gave me my change, I bit it, Matt. Just checking, love. It's not chocolate, you know what I mean? Two can play at that game, Flower. Eh? People apologise for change as well. Can I give you all this change, love? Can I get rid of all this shrapnel? Can I get rid of all this shit on your love? Can I shit on your love? Can I get rid of all this? Oh, no, we're glad of it. We're glad of it, aren't we, Barbara? We're glad of it. We need it. Oh, you've come at right time. We're glad of it. I went to Chippy on a Friday night, right? Chippy tea, like you do. It's a law. I went in. I gave her a £20 note, this woman. Now, as she's putting it into till, she turns to the other woman who's serving behind the counter, right? Oh, hear me out. She, they, do, they do this in Greg's. And she's putting it in. She's, she says to the woman, 20 pound going in, Marion. 20 going in, love. I said, hey, mouth. <laughs> There's two drug dealers hiring me up for me change here. He's got 17 pound shares, that lad. <laughs> I'm going to be lying up front street in a minute, covered in peas, winded. <laughs> oh. They don't do peas down south. I went down south doing some shows, went to a chippy. I said, uh, chips and peas, please, don't do peas. <laughs> you what? We don't do peas. <laughs> they don't do peas. <laughs> they don't do... That's my friend, he's outside through the window. <laughs> You've got to talk like that through glass. <laughs> they don't do peas. <laughs> curry snow, curry snow, curry snow. They do curry sauce. Don't do curry sauce, mate. What? We don't do curry sauce. They don't do curry sauce. Curry sauce, no go, no go. 
gravy. Gravy. Gra they don't do gravy. They don't do gravy. <laughs> My friend come in, he said, hey, how's that out moist? <laughs> how's that out moist? <laughs> Forget it, we're going. <laughs> 20 pound going in. And if you miss any of these programmes now, not that you can, because the loops every hour, you can get on t internet now, get an iPlayer or 4OD, you can download you can download them to your thigh phone now. You can watch them when you go and work, your battery on the last six minutes. But you, my whole life's on charge. Are you saying? I can't sleep at night for green flashing lights in bedroom. I'm like, Christ, I'm a fucking spaceship. <laughs> texting? I've got that bad with texting now. I don't even give me mum three rings when I get anywhere anymore. I just text her the words, three rings, send. <laughs> That's an illness. That's a disease, that. I got a silent call on my own phone. You know when they don't speak, and I were coming out of the bedroom in the morning, I answered it. Hello? But I could hear someone breathing. So I knew they were there. I can hear you breathing. Hello? Can you hear me? I can hear you breathing. I thought it's some weirdo. Two can play at this game, dickhead. It's all right. You won a war, you've got a war. So I sat on stairs and I waited. Hey, I waited for a good 40 minutes. I sat there and then it started freaking me out. So I thought, oh no, I've had enough of this. So I went, I hung up, put it back in its holster, in the kitchen. Anyway, I went off. I did some bits, like I bleached my cloths. And, uh, well, you've got to. And then I came back after about 20 minutes and I picked it up again and there were dialing tone. So I did 1471, and they're a number. I thought, ah, I've got you, bastard. <laughs> so I pressed three, and my mobile rang in my pocket. <laughs> I must have bent down in the bedroom, picked my slippers up, and accidentally dialed our house. So now I'm sat halfway downstairs, listening to myself breathing via satellite. For 40 minutes, cost me £62, pound, that call. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you this one. I went to pie shop. <laughs> I went to pie shop. I gave her a, 20, I gave her a £10 pound note, right? And she gave me my change. She went, there you go, love. 718, she wants your twos, you want your five, 10, 50 and 10, your shit. I said, hey, what's that you saying to me? What's that? Couch change it into me, and 718, you want your twos, you want your five, ten, fifty, and ten, your change. Oh, much obliged to you. Come again. Maybe that's just mathematical bollocks. What are you saying to me? Do you want pick a lily? I'd rather lick my own arsehole, though, if you don't mind. Right? Pick a lily! What's that? What's pick a lily? Don't eat anything that's luminous. You'll be drinking mild next. Scientists don't know. I bought a steak and kidney pie. She went, there you go, love. Watch me juices. I said, hey, 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 hey. I want a pie, not your life story. Eh, what's the matter with you? <laughs> slimming World, red and green days. Who goes Slimming World? <laughs> slimming World. I went once. <laughs> it's, um, if you don't know what Slimming World is, it's like Weight Watchers, but it's a quid cheaper. <laughs> so, red and green days. I went once. Methodist, Methodist Church Hall in Bolton. Thursday night, all women sat round in semicircle. Let's have a look at you girls now. Big round of applause for Debbie. This week she's lost a pound. I said, I shit a pound. What's that? <laughs> One pound, big deal. Cost me 350, get in, what's a pound? <laughs> John, at the back. Any problems this week, John, love? Yeah, I can't poo. <laughs> I said, oh, too much information, John. We didn't need all that. I'm eating a Nutri-Grain here, dirty bitch. <laughs> want that, want that. <laughs> Carol, at the back. What's happened here, love? What's happened here? You were doing really well, really well. You nearly had your half stone sticker. <laughs> What's going on, love? I'm looking here now, at my hand. <laughs> and I'm worried. What happened? Oh, we're doing really well. And it, it got to Wednesday. <laughs> and I don't know. I just... Come on, tell us, share it with the group. Come on. Come on, we're all nosy bitches. Tell us. <laughs> um, it got to Wednesday. And... 
I brought one of my nails and I had a fry up. <laughs> oh, we've all been there, girls, we've all been there. Give Carol a round of applause anyway for trying. The trying what? Cooking oil? That bitch, what's she tried? What's she tried? Don't clap her. <laughs> Carol, take the sea off chips. What do you get? <laughs> it's up to you, love. I can't do it for you. Hey, garlic bread. Hey, it's the future, lads. Did you get your mum that bungalow? Yeah, she wants a new carpet now.